In this video, we will demonstrate how to make an edible water bottle, like this. To do this, you will need two containers, a slotted spoon, one gram of sodium alginate, and five grams of calcium lactate. These can be found from specialized kitchen stores, or you can just purchase them online. A pH meter is helpful if the pH value of the liquid you plan to spherify is unknown. A spoon or spoons, these will determine the size of your water bottle. The larger the spoon, the larger the bottle. A measuring cup and a blender. To start, add one cup of water to the blender. Add one gram of your sodium alginate. Then blend until combined. Try not to overblend this as it will introduce extra air bubbles. Leave the mixture to sit for 15 minutes, during which time the liquid will turn from white to clear. After 15 minutes have passed, add 4 cups of water to the blender and add 5 grams of calcium lactate. Blend until combined. Add the calcium mixture to the second bowl. Use your spoon to scoop up some of the sodium alginate solution and gently place this into the calcium lactate. Leave these in the calcium lactate solution for 3 minutes. The longer the sodium alginate spends in the calcium lactate solution, the thicker and stronger the coating surrounding the trapped water will become. So, for firmer water bottles, leave the sodium alginate longer than 3 minutes. Use your slotted spoon to remove the spheres from the calcium lactate solution and place them into a water bath or rinse them under the tap. This step will remove the calcium lactate from the outside layer, stopping the reaction. The bottles are now complete. As you can see, the easy process has formed a perfect edible bottle with our captured water inside. Time for a taste test. So to get to the liquid inside, you can bite through the pod and discard the biodegradable membrane, or you can eat the whole thing. And that's how straightforward it is to make an edible drink bottle. Let us know if you try this experiment at home. We hope that you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.